What is up guys, this is Max Square, and in this video we're going to be kicking off the first of the mini tutorials for the channel. So in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to install fonts on your Mac. So the first thing you need to do is find a font. Now I'm going to be using this quicksand font from fontsworld.com and this is a free font website but I'll leave a list of other websites where you can get free fonts from in the description so be sure to check that out. So once you found your font, you're going to want to hit the download button wherever that may be. And this is where it is for us at the top right. So I'm going to click that and it's going to download a zip file. Next, if you head over to Finder, you'll see that in our downloads folder in the sidebar that this quicksand.zip is now there. So you can just double click this to um, open all the files. And now if your font does not come in a zip file and it's just one of these files, what you can do to install it is just double click it. But since we have a bunch of files, we're going to select all of them by hitting the top one, then holding shift and hitting the bottom one, and it'll select all of those. Then you can just double click it, and it will pop up with a new window where you can install all the weights. So all these files are just different weights. You can see we have regular, we have light, and bold, and the italic versions of all of those. And so it's going to install all of those in one go. So we can just hit that install button, and your font is installed. And now the fun part is of course testing out the font. So if you open up text edit, you can just open that app right there, create a new document and type in, this is some awesome text. You can select all of that text and change it to your new font, which is quicksand. I'm gonna make this nice and big so y'all can see it. And there is our new font, quicksand installed and ready to go. So that wraps up the first mini tutorial. I hope you guys found that helpful and I'll see you in the next one.